remember the chief of defense staff has also spoken out on uh, the Manipur situation saying it has nothing to do with counterinsurgency but is primarily a clash between the two ethnic communities there. Uh, he's also talked about uh, uh, the efforts ongoing in order to save a uh, maximum number of lives, highlighting the fact that before 2020, uh, there was army uh, which was deployed in the state of Manipur. But after challenges on the northern border, some of the troops were actually withdrawn uh, from the state. Let's listen in to what the Chief of Defence Staff has had to say. Manipur situation, uh, you see when this, uh, I'll connect it with the question which you had earlier asked, the gentleman over there. In 2020, uh, before 2020, there was army, there was Assam rifles all deployed in the state of Manipur for uh, counterinsurgency operations. But since the challenges of the northern borders were far more, uh, we were able to withdraw the army and the situation we thought had normalized. At least the insurgency part, that had normalized. And we were able to pull out the army units and they had all gone to the northern borders. Uh, Unfortunately, this particular situation which is developed into Manipur has nothing to do with you know, counter-insurgency or insurgency. It's primarily a clash between two ethnicities. And it's a law and order kind of a situation which we are helping the state government. So while we were there uh, to fight insurgency, that level certainly has come down, had come down, come down enough to that level which permitted us to actually withdraw the armed forces from there. But right now we are into a different situation altogether, trying to separate out the communities which are, you know, at ethnic, uh, because of ethnicity and number of clashes which are happening. Uh, we've done an excellent job, Assam Rifles and Armed Forces, and may have saved a large number of lives. The challenges in Manipur have not gone, means they're not disappeared. They, means, uh, one way to say, uh, it'll take some time actually, but uh, hopefully, uh, they should settle down. The state government should be able to do their job with CAPF, etc. And uh, armed forces should be back to looking at the challenge, which you said has not yet disappeared from the northern border. So that's important for us.